the day is finally upon us. The most feared players have finally been enraged. And so I'm going to start off by showing you guys some of my most feared cards, some of my cards that have just became enraged. Uh, John Beeson, this guy was so good with Carolina. I'm not even gonna read off the tribute to this guy because it, they're just so good that like most of these most feared cards, their tributes are just ridiculous. 90 speed, 99 catch. Uh, Anquan Bold, 99 catch in traffic. I mean, the only thing Anquan was really missing on his card was speed, I think. And with this one, already at a, a 95 overall, like I'm, I'm legit scared to go into head-to-head -head games. Like if you go in, uh, oh yeah, this is uh, Colin Kaepernick, uh, guys. Kaepernick. Like I tried to do a little introduction thing. It didn't really work, but Cap, 92 speed, 99 throw power. I don't know. I don't really think this car got that much better. To be honest, like I'm sure the attributes look a whole lot better and all that stuff, but considering the jump that like a lot of these other cards took, that Colin Kaepernick jump was kind of mediocre to me. It, it, at least to me. So this is the guy uh, I pulled out of my most feared, not most feared, well, my, my set, the Terra set, I think it's called. 101 strength, 100 run block, Megusta, 97 pass block, and a 90 impact block. He even has some nice Excel if I want to go ahead and run those screenplays. So this is just a warning. Don't go out buying cards today because most feared cards, like you see these high overall, they're going to drop. I repeat, they're going to drop. It was my first year playing Mutt last year. I made the mistake. 98 Pursuit. Have ah, mercy. Uh, Khalil Mack. Man, Raiders. Shout out Raiders fans. Times will be better. Like I was saying though, don't get a most feared card. Think you're getting this high overall that's going to stay. Unless they're an elite card, their overall is going to drastically drop. Even elites, their overall drop by like seven points after Halloween weekend. Brandon Merriweather had a phenomenal game against the Cowboys that Redskins defense showed me something man that was impressive a great uh and I'm trying to think of the defensive coordinator's name but he called a great game Merriweather was in posi uh, position to make plays a lot man uh yeah though uh, his hit power though a 90 I don't know most feared I figured it'd be a little higher I thought he was a, a pretty solid hitter uh maybe maybe not I really haven't seen many Redskins games recently so Pat Pete this is what the people want to hit, Pat Pete. Check it out, man. The car, it, it, it looks nice. I, I killed the thumbnail game with a Pat Pete before. Like, you guys saw, I kind of, I tried to make him look like a ghost. 99 speed, 100 excel, 82 awareness. Wow. What? Can't believe his awareness is so. It doesn't even matter, though. 99 man coverage, 95 zone, the press, the play rack. The play rack leaves a little bit to be desired. But we don't need him to recognize plays because he's so good all around like that speed he's going to make up for anything and cards like this are the exact reason that if i didn't have any most feared cards i wouldn't hop into head to head even if i even if i did have some most feared cards like i do i'm only hopping in the head to head for you guys this weekend like, I'm in my Super Bowl right now, and my, my Super Bowl is going to be a most feared Super Bowl. Go figure. But luckily, as we see Steve Smith on the screen with that disgusting catching and catching traffic and a nice speed. Wow. Figured he'd get a little better release being uh, enraged. But the only reason I'm hopping in the head to head is to get some gameplay because it's going to be some fun. It's going to be some cheesy. I know you guys are going to want gameplay. Like, it might. It's going to be fun to play, probably. But I'm going to be much more prone to catching an L, is what I'm trying to say. Because people are going to have unreal cards. And yeah, yeah, I'm going to have them too, but what if they have more than me? It's just the way Mutt works, I guess. Ike Taylor. It's 97 zone coverage, 93 man, 97 speed, 6 foot 2. So pretty good height, 84 awareness. And Delaney Walker, this guy. 92 speed one of the faster tight ends in the league 95 catching traffic 96 catch at uh six foot he's not a taller tight end wow this is one of the shorter tight ends i've actually seen in recent time everybody's tight end now seems like they're six five uh six four maybe six three at the shortest but here we go terrell sucks t sizzle ball so hard want to show you guys some of the elite enraged most feared players and i'm going to try 
to do a good job of that. I'm sorry if I miss anybody. Check out the play wreck from Ball So Hard. The tackle, the block shed. If you're looking for an outside linebacker, this is your guy. If Well, a 3-4 outside linebacker. Because if you're going to play him in a 4-3, you're not really... You're just limiting yourself, and don't do that. So, Brian Cushing, let's go ahead and take a look at his attributes. A 99 tackle, a 92 speed, a 97 play right. So, yeah, this guy can play in your 3-4, your 4-3. Looks like he's going to shoot the gaps like a monster. Once again, just a public service announcement. These cards are going to drop overall Monday. I think like what it's gonna end. Well, I don't ex I don't know the exact time it's going to end. I'm assuming midnight on the weekend, but uh, don't quote me on that. Oh, check this out: the limited edition Patrick Willis. You see, you see why I don't want to hop in the head-to-head -head games. How? How do you even? How? How? I'm at a loss for words right now. 100 tackle. This is like a golden ticket, Ray Lewis or something. 95 block shed, 95 strength, 96 speed, 85 zone cut. Man, what? You put this dude at quarter at cornerback? Like it's ridiculous, man. You should be you should be able to do that. But it's it's all in the most feared fun. Trent Williams, Pro Bowl left tackle with the 99 strength, the 99 pass block, 93 run block. This is one of the more practical most feared cards, in my opinion. 90 impact block. So you guys, uh, I don't know if I went to Phil Lo Did I? Yeah, I think I, did. I showed you guys him already, right? Because he was on my team. So you could actually build pretty solid line. Uh, well, at least on the left tackle and the right tackle. I think those are the only two offensive linemen that I can think of elite that are most feared. 95. This card. Oh, man, this was kind of disappointing to me. Because Troy Polamalu, this is his most feared enraged version. And it's only at 80 zone coverage. 75, man. Like, I know this isn't the Troy Palomalu of recent years. And only a 92 hit power. But I, I just don't agree with that. To, to say this card is supposed to be like Berserk, an uh, animal, like, you know, something unreal. Check this out, though. Dez Bryant. One of the best receivers in the game currently. Uh, doing big things in Dallas. 96 speed, 99 catch, 97 catch in traffic. This is actually the card that I wanted to pull instead of Pat Pete when I was uh, pulling those most fear packs. But you could bet, like, I'll, I'll go fine with Pat Pete. It's ridiculous. So, scrolling, we haven't even got to the most ridiculous cards yet. I isn't that hard to believe? Look at this guy. Look at this guy. Like, no shit. Like, look at this guy. Like, he doesn't he not look ridiculous. Limited edition Marshawn, Beast Mode, 99 speed, 100 carry. This. What? 101 truck 95 elusiveness 99 ball carrier vision you better have a most feared patrick willis to bring this guy down <laughs> if you plan on going into head-to-head -head game man i'm probably exaggerating probably maybe i'm not i don't, I don't think i'm exaggerating i think head-to-head -head is going to be littered with most feared players everywhere hopefully you won't play that guy that's bought like a couple of most feared bundles like myself I, i'm actually going to probably buy another bundle so uh i'm trying to see if i missed anybody and i probably did so if i did i apologize i just i just don't see him on the screen right here uh, i hope you guys enjoyed the commentary be sure to leave a thumbs up and subscribe for more madden 15 ultimate team if you did enjoy it. i'm d coop and i'm out i want to start things off by saying like i'm actually legit kind of shocked that kenny vaccaro is uh the rising 